This is the article on the family Hippopotamidae. For the main article on hippos, see Hippopotamus. Hippopotamus is a stout, naked skinned, and amphibious artiodactyl members of the family Hippopotamidae possessing three chambered stomachs and walking on four toes on each foot, while they resemble pigs physiologically and a pseudorominance like camels, their closest living relatives are actually the cetaceans. There are two living species of hippopotamus in two genera, the pygmy hippo, Choeropsis liberiensis of the forests of West Africa, and the common hippo, Hippopotamus amphibious. Characteristics Hippopotamuses are large mammals with short, stumpy legs and barrel-shaped bodies. They have large heads with broad mouths and nostrils placed at the top of the snouts. Like pigs, they have four toes, but unlike pigs, all of the toes are used in walking. Hippopotamids are ungulagrade, although unlike most other such animals, they have no hooves. Instead using a pad of tough connective tissue on each foot, the stomachs have three chambers, but they are not true ruminants. The living species are smooth-skinned and lack both sebaceous glands and sweat glands. The outer epidermis is relatively thin, so hippos dehydrate rapidly in dry environments. Both the incisors and canines are large and tusk-like, although the canine tusks are by far the larger. The tusks grow throughout life. The post-canine teeth are large and complex, suited for chewing the plant matter that comprises the diets. The number of incisors varies even within the same species, but the general dental formula is evolution. The hippopotamids are descended from the Anthrocodes, a family of semi-aquatic and terrestrial artiodactyls that appeared in the late Eocene, and are thought to have resembled small and arrow headed hippos. More specifically, the hippos split off from the Anthrocodes some time during the Miocene. After the appearance of the true hippopotamids, the Anthrocodes went into a decline brought about by a combination of climatic change and competition with the descendants, until the last genus, Marichipotamus, died out in the early Pliocene of India. There were once many species of hippopotamid, but only two survive today, Hippopotamus amphibious and Choeropsis liberiensis. They are the last survivors of two major evolutionary lineages, the hippos proper and the pygmy hippos. Respectively, these lineages could arguably be considered subfamilies, but the relationship to each other, apart from being fairly distant relatives, is not well resolved. The enigmatic Miocene Kenyapotamus is insufficiently known to be assigned a place in the hippo phylogeny with any degree of certainty. In addition, the genus Hexaprotodon, in a sense now restricted to an extinct group of animals once living around the northern and northeastern Indian Ocean, which formerly included most ancient hippos, has turned out to be paraphyletic. Taxonomy Analogous Structures The lower canine teeth of hippopotamids are similar in function and structure to the tusks of elephants. While hippopotamids and elephants are only very distantly related within the mammalia, the lower canine teeth of both groups so long and have a slight curve, and species of both families use this structure when fighting. Species the systematics and taxonomy used here mostly follows the review of Bossary, genus Hippopotamus, true Hippopotami Hippopotamus amphibious, Hippopotamus Africa, Hippopotamus antiquus, mainland Europe and AMP, British Isles, Pleistocene Hippopotamus Kreuzbergi, Crete, Pleistocene, Hippopotamus minor, Cyprus, Pleistocene to Holocene Hippopotamus melitensis, Malta, Pleistocene, Pleistocene Hippopotamus Pentlandi, Sicily, Pleistocene, Hippopotamus Lemuli, Madagascar, Holocene Hippopotamus Lilumena, Madagascar, Holocene, Hippopotamus Gorgibs, Africa and mainland Europe, Late Miocene Middle Pleistocene.
tentatively placed into a hippopotamus, Hippopotamus Ethiopicus, Kenya and Amp, Ethiopia, Pliocene, Pleistocene, Hippopotamus afarensis, formerly a genus Trilobophorus, Hippopotamus behemoth, Israel, early Pleistocene, Hippopotamus chysensis, Central Africa, Pliocene, Hippopotamus sirensis, Morocco and Amp, Algeria, Pleistocene, genus Hexaprotodon, Hex Hexaprotodons or Asian hippopotamuses Hexaprotodon brunetti Ethiopia Pliocene Hexaprotodon corundoni Ethiopia Pliocene Hexaprotodon cruce fonti Spain Late Miocene Hexaprotodon hipponensis Algeria Hexaprotodon omegunculus Uganda and Congard Pliocene Hexaprotodon arivaticus Myanmar Pliocene Pleistocene Hexaprotodon caramensis Kenya and Eritrea Pleistocene Hexaprotodon madagascariensis Madagascar Holocene Hexaprotodon Namad Indicus, India, Hexaprotodon Pali Indicus, India, Hexaprotodon Pantanelli, Italy, Pliocene, Hexaprotodon Protamphibius, Kenya and Chad, Pliocene, Hexaprotodon Siculus, Hexaprotodon Savajavanicus, Indonesia, Hexaprotodon Surveillances, India, Hexaprotodon SP. Myanmar, genus Archaeopotamus, formerly included in Hexaprotodon Archaeopotamus Harvardi, Arabian Peninsula and Central Africa, Miocene, Pliocene, Archaeopotamus Lothagamensis, Kenya, Miocene, one or two undescribed species. Genus Choropsis Choropsis Liberiensis Pygmy Hippopotamus Genus Saeotherium Formerly included in Hexaprotodon Saeotherium Mingotschad Pliocene 